गाइस वेलकम बैक टू टेक डोज एंड इन दिस वीडियो वी विल सी द मैक्सिमल स्कोर आफ्टर अप्लाइंग की ऑपरेशंस प्रॉब्लम व्हिच इज फ्रॉम लीड कोड नंबर 2530 लेट्स नाउ लुक एट द प्रॉब्लम स्टेटमेंट इन दिस प्रॉब्लम यू आर गिवन अ जीरो इंडेक्स्ड इंटीजर एरे नम्स एंड एन इंटीजर के यू हैव अ स्टार्टिंग स्कोर ऑफ जीरो इन वन ऑपरेशन यू कैन चूज एनी इंडेक्स आई फ्रॉम द गिवन एरे एंड वी कैन इंक्रीज आवर गिवन स्कोर स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम जीरो वी कैन ऐड द नम्स एट आई and then we have to replace the num set i which we had chosen in step number 1 and replace it by seal of nums of i by 3 return the maximum possible score you can attain after applying exactly k number of operations and the sealing function is the least integer uh, greater than or equals to value okay so let's look at some constraints before we actually uh, look at some examples so in this case they are mentioning that the array is at least having one size and each of the value can be 10 to the power of 9 so let's say you end up having k value equals to 10 to the power of 5 and the nums length is also let's say same or whatever it can be then the maximum uh, value that means the maximum score that you can end up with is 10 to the power 9 added 10 to the power 5 times so that can be 10 to the power of 14 and definitely you know that it is outside of 32 bit integer so we will take long long integer which is a 64 bit integer in this case okay now let's look at some examples for better understanding let's say that uh, in this case the given array is 582 and our k value is equals to 3 now we have to calculate the answer in this case which will say about what will be the maximal score we can pick out of picking one item after another so we have to pick items 3 times and 3 times the items will be reduced as well in the first attempt we can choose either 5 or 8 or 2 whatever it is okay now if you try out all possibilities then for k equals to 1 that means for the first time you are picking you can either pick 5 or 8 or 2 okay and then replace the value and when uh, we do it for the second time let's say for k equals to 2 then we will again be trying to choose either from 5 8 2 and the updated value as well right so every time you will have n number of choices which is array size and we are doing it k number of times so the number of choices will be n to the power of k okay and we know that this is not the complexity that we are looking for therefore we need to devise certain better algorithm now if you look at the answer for this then we will be picking 8 first so our score will start from 0 we will be picking 8 first so uh, the score will be updated by 8 we will do plus 8 to the score and this value will be reduced by 8 divided by 3 and you take the seal of it so this will be equals to let's say 2 point something so 2 point x and if you take the seal of it if x is not equals to 0 definitely then this will become 3 and that is why this 8 became 3 here and rest of the values will not be touched now in this uh, step let's say for k equals to 2 now uh, we will be picking one more item picking 5 was helpful for us to get to the optimal answer so let's say we picked 5 and so the score will become 13 in this case and then we we will reach to 2 3 2 okay because 5 divided by 3 5 by 3 and uh, taking the seal of it will be equals to 2 so that is why this is 2 now the third uh, time if we do it then let's say we picked 3 and uh, we if we divide 3 by 3 and take the seal it will be 1 so 2 1 2 and the value 3 will be added so this will become 16 so the answer in this case is 16 right so our goal here is to maximize the score whatever choices we make we need to always find the maximal score possible so that there should not be any other combination or any other way of making choices which is giving me a better answer right that should not happen now let's uh, look at another example let's say example 2 has k value 5 and we have just two elements 1 and 1 now in this case you can pick whichever element you want and when we pick let's say this one then this 1 by 3 and taking the seal of it it will be 1 so this one became 1 and we added score 1 now again you have 1 one, 1 one. again you can pick any one let's say we pick this one so again uh, this will reduce to be 1 so 1 will never get reduced to 0 right and you see this 1 one, 1 one will always remain and the k number of times we will do the operation and the maximal score will be 5 so since the constraint already mentioned that we will have at least one element in the array and whatever may be the value of k you will never run out of items because no item will be reduced to zero if it is not already zero because of the seal function so let's look at the idea for solving this problem now the idea is simple we have to go with the greedy idea we have only limited picks available with us which is k picks 
and we must maximize our score in each step so that we can reach to the maximal score so uh, we are starting with 582 let's say we are taking the same example and if we have to do it in k equals to 3 steps then it is always optimal to pick the maximal value because if you don't pick the maximal value then you will not get the maximum score because whatever value you pick it gets added isn't it and since we have limited step and since we are also never going to run out of items so always pick the max value so pick 8 and uh, if you pick 8 then to the final score let's say i take i take it as a uh, 0 i will initialize it with 0 i will be picking the max value picking the max value can uh, efficiently happen if you build a max heap out of it okay i will show you in the code uh, but let's say that it is already inserted into a max heap and so uh, 8 will be picked and so score will be added with plus 8 so score became 8 and 8 by 3 seal will become 3 okay 8 by 3 will give you 2 point something and so this will become 3 so this became 3 and the rest items will not be touched so now k value will decrease to 2 now in the next step again you will pick the maximum value so that maximum value will be 5 again when you had changed this 8 to 3 the 3 will be pushed back into your heap right so the heap will always maintain n items so when you uh, pick this 5 then again this 5 will be reduced to a new number 5 by 3 seal of it will become 2 and you will be adding 5 to your score so this becomes 13 and this became 2 3 2 again your k value became 1 again you do one more step and you will pick 3 now so your score will be added with plus 3 this became 16 so the changes will be 3 by 3 uh, seal will be 1 and this becomes 2 okay so we have run out of the k steps the k became 0 and we have to stop and our final score is our maximal answer which we had solved greedily using a max heap so the idea is whenever you are given the initial array you have to push all these items into a max heap so which algorithm is efficient we will use the build heap algorithm we, we should not push the items one by one because that will be n log n if you use build heap algorithm that will be order of n if you are not sure about how heap works then you should watch my playlist of entire heap where I have uh, given step by step breakdown of uh, all the algorithms step by step heapify build heap and everything so you can find the link in the description and also in the i button now once you have uh, applied the build heap we are uh, taking out an item one time and then pushing the item after making the change that means after dividing it and how many times are we doing we are doing it k times so after building the heap you are doing k times push and pop so k times log of n okay because n is the number of items so the time complexity in this case is n plus k log n which is equals to k log n or you can also keep it as n plus k log n because n and k are not dependent actually so you can keep it as it is and the space complexity is order of n right so let's now look at the code if you are someone who is looking to prepare for top product based company within a limited time of just three months then we have brought for you both the dsa and the system design live interview training program the most important feature of this program is you get a filtered and condensed structured curriculum in-depth discussion of all the topics and my guarantee of your understanding one-on-one -on -one guidance with me and live weekend classes to know more about the training you can whatsapp us on this given number i had already explained why we are defining long long uh, because this will be outside of 32-bit integer and we are building the heap here which is order of n and i will be initializing the score value again with the long long integer and uh, i will be repeating the process k times and every time i will be picking the max value from the heap and then adding it to the score and uh, updating the current value which was picked from the heap by uh, taking the seal of current by 3 and then again pushing it back into the max heap uh, if i repeat it k times then after that whatever is the score will be definitely the maximum possible score i hope you were able to understand this if you still have any doubt then please feel free to comment below and i'll try to help you as soon as possible like and share our video and subscribe to our channel in order to watch more of this programming video see you guys in the next video thank you